Hi, today I've got another really rare item to show you and it is this fantastic silver beaker. Now I'll give you a second to decide how old you think it is. It's quite plain, conical cool shape on the side and a little bit of engraving on there. Well, if you know your silver, you'll know that this dates from the end of the 17th century. It was actually made in the year or there, around 1670, so during the reign of Charles II. So 1670 is the year that Charles II uh, and Louis XIV of France signed the declaration to end the hostilities together. So if you imagine what history this little silver beaker has seen or witnessed in its life. Now, it's not just rare because of its age, it's rare because of the marks that it carries on the bottom. Now they're a little bit worn away unfortunately, but they're clear enough for us to read and a little bit of research in Charles Jackson's Guide to Hallmarks here, we realise that they are by a certain John Douthwaite working in Newcastle at the very end of the 17th century. Now it's very rare to find provincial silver fully marked of this date, so for that reason it's going to carry an estimate at auction possibly of three to five thousand pounds. Now when you're selling silver for this age, again condition plays a big part. Now as you can see here there's a little bit of a crease, there's a few little dents around the body here. Now that is going to make a difference but in reality it's survived hundreds of years so you can forgive it for having these little defects. Now again a few little features to note on here. You're in the 17th century so you can see the tulips. Of course the Dutch golden age was running throughout the 17th century. So it's no surprise that we find tulips around there. So what a fantastic rare survivor from 17th century England.